Kelly Morrison. Thank you and welcome to the Valder Beebe Show live from Dallas, Texas. I'm well. How are you? Very, very well and very nice to be talking to you today. Thank you. Well, I want my audience to know Sally Morrison. She's the director of PR at Natural Diamonds at the Beers Group. And, you know, it's diamonds for the holidays. Well, Sally, I'm on board with you. Great. <laughs> Can you tell us some of the latest diamond jewelry trends? Absolutely, yes, absolutely. Well, what we're seeing is, you know, a return to classics, pieces that we've seen around for a long time, but worn in kind of fresh and a little bit more modern ways. As an example, uh, diamond tennis uh, tennis bracelets, you know, we've been around for a long time, kept for special occasions, you know, worn out with a little black dress. We're now seeing them kind of worn more casually, perhaps with T-shirts, perhaps for day wear, and, and, and increasingly in yellow and rose metal, as well as in the classic white. So we've got some here from Zales, of course, store headquartered right there with you in Dallas. Um, they sent through us a beautiful example here of a, of, a, of a white gold and a yellow gold tennis necklace. So these are uh, really on trend right now. Okay, so even though we're coming into the holiday season, it's topped by the engagement season, correct? Absolutely, yes. I mean, more people get engaged this time of the year than any other. And again, we're seeing a return to classics, like simple engagement rings or perhaps with a pave, maybe a classic three stone, but with a little bit of a twist. So here again, we have also actually from Zales, this beautiful teardrop, you know, pear shape. We're seeing fancy shapes make a comeback. We also have a, a really beautiful heart shape here from actually Ben Bridge Jewelers. So hearts, ovals, you know, interesting shapes, but in a pretty classic setting. Actually, until I uh, saw or recently, someone close to me saw their ring. Rings are trendy like other things. You can kind of tell the era that people are married in. That's Meaning, right. Meaning, if I look at someone in the 60s, I can tell their ring from someone today. Yes, yes, for sure, for sure. That's very interesting. Okay, so besides uh, uh, these pieces, what do women want in, in diamonds? Well, we just did some research on this, and first of all, over 80% of people we talked to said they would be very excited to have a piece of natural diamond jewelry for Christmas. So that's that's good news, right? Um, but beyond that, their very favorite, most desired piece was diamond studs. And again, I think diamond studs are great because they exist at a variety of budgets, right? You can get little ones, you can get big ones, but you have that little piece of eternity right close to your face, a little bit of light on your face. And again, it's a piece of jewelry that you can wear every day. You don't have to take it off when you go to yoga or go on your carpool. You can just leave those little diamond studs on. Well, that's interesting because I'm a diamond stud girl. The only thing I suggest they need to sell them in threes because I always <laughs> lose one. So, I love a diamond stud earring. Okay, can you say, tell me um, about designers. Just like we have designers in clothes and, and, and couture, we have designers in, in diamonds and jewelry. Exactly, and we've seen some very interesting, new, diverse voices in the in the in the natural diamond space this year. One of them is this incredible here um, designer called Matteo. He's based in Houston, Texas. He made these unbelievable earrings uh, for Sarah Paulson this year, and she wore them on the red carpet. They're fantastic. Check out his website. He makes incredible jewelry. Um, we also have this amazing choker from a brand called Almasica. And she made this choker for Amanda Seyfried, who, who again wore it on the red carpet. She is a Chicago-based designer, very much a new talent. So there's lots of great new exciting voices in that space. And before I let you go, what said the be De Beers apart from other jewelry stores? Well, we're, we're not a jewelry store, right? De Beers Group is, is, is a miner of diamonds. We discover diamonds from all over the world, including Southern Africa, and we um, absolutely specialize in ethical and sustainably sourced natural diamonds. Great. I'm so glad you put that straight for us. Where can we go for more information? For more information, go to adiamondisforever.com. Thank you for being my guest on the Val Drabibi Show, and happy holidays early to you. Happy holidays. Thank you. Hi, I'm Val Drabibi, host of the Val Drabibi Show.
We have over 1,000 videos on ValderBBShow.com and YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. We upload new videos daily. Our site is a modern baby boomer platform with news and information important to boomers. Subscribe to YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow and stay connected as I interview the world's most fascinating people.